Hey, hello everybody. Um, thanks for the thumbs up. Uh, yeah, I'm. Uh, we're a bit running behind time tonight. Um, all because we just filmed. Um, we just filmed a very special video. Uh, so yeah, let me just get the comments windows up so I can see who's out there. Let's know who's in the house. Um, SJ's just. She's dashing upstairs at the moment. She's actually. I think she's making a coffee. Um, hey, hey, Lee, aha, see, now I've got the comments up. Uh, team early, usually team L. Um, uh, uh, and Jay Dolan's in the house. That's nice to see. How you doing? Um, hey, Grease, how you doing? Strix, what, what's up? Uh, this is good to see everybody's here, nice and early. Uh, Leo Vera's in the house. What's up, guys? Uh, Sweatshirt, Mister. See, I, I, I reckon like I am, I am like an iguana or something, and so um, I just love it when it's really warm. And uh, well, we are in the basement, although there are lights that on down here. It's pretty bright in here tonight, as we've, uh, as I said, we've been filming a video. Um, SJ's brought me the obligatory coffee with the the one and only, the very unique. Um, the very unique pint of stuff stuff coffee mug which um, says on it pray for gum soles in fact we'll flick to the other camera there you can see that better it's nice and bright and uh, boom look at that it's a it's about it's about 30 in your attic well it's a good job I'm not in your attic um, that's all I'm gonna say Levi um, I'm uh, pray for gum soles indeed indeed we always do it's um I don't know I think I think it's about 21 degrees outside 22 degrees outside but like it's it's always like it's always a fairly steady temperature in the bottom of our house and in this reason we're not that late the annex uh, I'm gonna say evening to you because uh, SJ's just got down here what, what are you looking for SJ? I don't know I'm, I feel a bit lost if you go to the, uh, the creator studio oh dear um, and click the bat wings um, so yeah Oh my word! And um, I'm uh, and being a bit of a, I discovered a thing actually. Only twenty seven here in Texas. That sounds chilly for Texas, Strix. That sounds very chilly. It was twenty eight here on Monday. Um, it was. It was super trailer twenty eight. Uh, uh, Levi with the the notification squad for sure. Um, definitely. But um, yeah. So what was I saying? Um, yeah, I was just gonna say like that coffee. We um. I was I was in um, I was in randomly Austin of all places last year, and I discovered the delights of oat milk, which <laughs> sounds really peculiar. It sounds so hipster. It's, it sounds very <laughs> hipster. Well, I was in Austin, um, and anything is possible in Austin. Um, but yeah, I uh, I literally, I kind of at that moment decided that I prefer that in in, in milk in milk in coffee to the the normal milk, and so mm. yeah, it always. Um, it's a bit random. SJ's not feeling so well no, tonight. No, I'm not. I had a really bad migraine and ended up being up for most of the night. It's like so I'm not re feeling great. She she was complaining about the height of the mic stand on Sunday, and now it's like literally holding herself oh. over the top of it. Honestly, like my whole neck and everything is really achy as well. It's not good. It's not good, people. It's not good. But um, yeah, but we're here to talk some sneakers. We uh, are and, and things and. Um, you know, obviously, we usually have a bit of a beater of the week. Um, now, this beater of the week that I've got for you this week, uh, which, you know, many of you s have seen in the past, um, and it's not good. It's uh, I th We think SJ's migraines are related to the weather, um, and particularly uh, pressure changes or whatever, uh, it seems. Uh, yeah. And, and so when it's a bit potentially stormy, as well that that it has a has an impact and when we walked a dog earlier um it was muggy even as. though it's like super muggy it's like pretty humid here it was quite cloudy and so it just looked like it was brewing up for a bit of a storm and so we you know, we think that that might be why the there was a bit of a migraine last night it wasn't a bit well, it, it, right, it was a bit of an excessive <laughs> migraine versus 
what we've been dealing with recently. Oh dear. So uh, yeah, so but you know, obviously, I'm I want to talk about beta of the week now for these. Uh, Super bad sinuses. Well, See, I actually had an op for my yeah, my you had, sinuses. You did have an op yeah. for your sinuses, yeah, didn't you? Mm. Um, Hasn't really made any difference to the migraines, to be honest. You don't sound as, as blocked. I don't up. sound no. Like if you watch any of our, my early videos, I sound very different. So blocked up, it's very it's quite weird hearing myself. Mm. Um, but yeah, but anyway. Yeah. Anyway, anyway we digress. This isn't this isn't my great <laughs> my, my migraine help news. Migraine sinus session. session. <laughs> but we are going to talk about um, we are going to talk. Oh, oh yeah, we are going to talk about my um, hey horror king, um, my my beta of the week, which I'm kind of um, sad that these are now beaters. Um, I do tend to wear these most days now uh, and i have done for a while um now the blazing squad are going to laugh because you always laugh at me for not pulling out a dunk i did pull out some heavy heavily worn dunks everyone um but uh so here we go i told you it was a beta um but like I just love these too much, so it's the like the lights are a bit bright in here tonight. Um, but we have got the bruised peach, the GT blazer, and um, they they just they're like my go-to. Like and and look actually at the back. Now we talked about these. Right, if we have a look, uh, hopefully that's gonna you, come on. Focus, focus, people. Uh, it's just I don't know. It's too bright, but this bit's finally starting to. It's fi Aha! Now it wants to do it. Now it wants to do it. I don't know why that is. It's finally starting to lose its color. Um, but that this is ah uh, migraine and stuff. That would be um, Levi. You know what? So Levi's saying that these are these are classics. Oh, wrong one. Wrong wrong tweet. <laughs> wrong wrong tweet. Wrong wrong comment. They are, you know, I've looked for a, another pair since since we got these because I I just wear them so much. But I did pull out as well this week, which I haven't worn for ages. Um, I think you would have seen it on our story. I pulled out this premium brewing, all pink thing. Um, which is really nice. You've forgotten you had them. I've forgotten I had them. So let's go back to the main camera. But yeah, so... I love these too. I really wish I picked a pair of these up. And again, like for a basic blazer, like there's so many little details on them. Like, uh, right, I'm going to pull out the skanky in the side. I just want to show people the in, in, inside bit. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it has your foot imprint on oh it. Oh my God. That's disgusting. <laughs> That's disgusting. Okay. <laughs> We're never doing that again live. Oh my word. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah, it, that that was like oh right, well you can see where I put all the weight and like also <laughs> <laughs> oh my word that's amazing I tell you what I I just love the way that they've naturally worn uh -huh. and like they haven't worn quickly but just like enough yeah and they're just so nice they still look nice they still look good they just like they they're a bit beat but yeah I couldn't find a pair of them anywhere no in fact not many places had them in my size. Well, that's that's a, a standard practice, and mm. obviously, um, you know, when we think about that, uh, <laughs> reminding me of that <laughs> ice cream. <laughs> yeah, totally. Ice cream. Oh, yeah. I haven't had one of those for years. Like, so if if you're from the US, um, everyone, f f Funny Feet was an ice cream over here on a stick, which was in the shape of a f funny foot. It, it just doesn't sound appealing, does it? But trust me, it was lovely. Um, oh my word, Alwyn. <laughs> That is nuts. Um, wow. Okay, that's pretty hardcore. Um, Alwyn's with his thing. Um, yeah, that is. Ice cream is a throwback. Definitely. So. Um, <laughs> uh, God, who knew? So many of us had nose issues. Oh, wow, guys. <laughs> I thought it was just me. Yeah, I, I feel the odd one out. Um uh, I just sound funny. Ah, uh, see, you all missed my Instagram stories and I have my nose up. That was some interesting 
trippiness. Trippiness. <laughs> yeah, SJ's trippy Instagram story of um, <laughs> of uh, yeah, mine's just pointy. I have a pointy nose. Um, I don't know, like, if this is going to come across on the camera. Like, look how pointy that is. It's pretty pointy. Uh, <laughs> This isn't where I thought the waffle was going to go tonight. Um, so, yeah, so I found these pink Bruins, and they they, they look amazing. Uh, which brings us on to, um, did you did you check out the video that we dropped last night um, unboxing those Poet Bruins? Oh, my word. They are so good. Um, so, so good. Uh, Bruins. Bruins. Yes. Uh, but I also checked the Instagram. Like, they are, they just pop that swoosh everyone's still on the on the old nose gang <laughs> hashtag nose gang Hosta- <laughs> <laughs> I, I, oh my word i can't keep up with you guys i really can't it's uh it is what it is but yeah so i i just was really really impressed with them um pint of nose that's the alternate <laughs> channel that could be going in all the wrong directions oh, dear. um but yes so I, i'm i'm was pleasantly surprised like so we we took those pictures on foot of the bruins last night but i i walked around the, with the dog um yesterday uh with them on they look so good on foot yeah they, they do look really good yeah I, again I, I know we said this after we missed out on them first time but none of the original pictures did them justice no not at all not at all i am um, i'm so glad that they 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 found their way to us so uh thank you again um is amazing um and of course yesterday uh <laughs> dog care dog care <laughs> uh yes th- well you have a dog um it was it was gino um it was supposed to be gino grease um i obviously say the name wrong um clearly because i am atrocious with pronunciation um but yes that is his surname uh perfect footprint it, they're they're just a great shoe everyone such a great shoe but um i was i was really like we regretted as soon as we didn't get them first time that they came out um well you see our win i was kind of saving that for the end but yes we did get a bit of a win um on the chunky donkeys and we did just the reason why I was like a couple of minutes late is because we had we had literally just filmed the unboxing of those, and um, I I had like I was rushing around like literally right we got to take that off there got to put the desk thing back in got to whip the cards out the camera and all of that stuff, but 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 um, um, let us. Let us have a sneak peek for the guys on the guys with us on the Wednesday waffle. I think that that, that would be fine, wouldn't it? You'd all like to see the chunky donkeys. Um, it's uh, let, let's 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 have a look. Uh, right, where did I put them, SJ? Where did I put them? Um, oh, they're here. So oh yes. Right. So they come in a rainbow box. Do you want the box? Uh, we'll have a, yeah, do you want just the whole yeah. Let, let's do this. This is oh. this is a. Uh, this is amongst friends. No one will tell anyone that, that we're like that we've got a video dropping hopefully tomorrow night that you can all see properly and we show all the details. But have a look at these bad boys. Um, yeah, look at these. Like first of all, oh look at that. Right, we're gonna get that out there. Ho 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 ho. And then we're gonna get this one out like that because SJ hasn't actually had them in hand yet. I'm just going to put that box down gently. Well, see, normally I just throw these down, but um, oh my word! So, like, look at these. And I wanted to talk about the Kevin and Hell, but Alwyn's kind of outed me with with these bad boys. Outed you with these? What the? F- well, I was I was <laughs> like I was going to do these right right <laughs> at the end. Um, yeah. So, and and there is that store that the Finnish store as well, um, which I think you've entered. So, like, oh my word! I just want to like, it's not coming across on the camera. This is like a real vanilla custard yellow, <laughs> um, and it really because of the way they've cut this. I'm really impressed with how it it's 
it's hanging off. Come on, what was that new word you created? Oh, was it? I can't even remember what it was. He says something on the video, and it's just like, what on earth are you saying? Uh, it was in the, the meltability, the meltingness. The meltingness <laughs> of the ice cream really comes across <laughs> because, uh, and obviously, you know, Chunky Monkey is a banana ice cream, but like that, like really, really, like it's just so good. It's so good. And again, th this isn't really showing on, on these. Um, but like they're so so nice. Um, I think the other cool, the really interesting thing is this. This really works. This cow hair, um, this cow print here, that really really works. They're like they. I would say, they're definitely from a brand point of view. If you were Ben and Jerry's, as a brand, they've done such a good job. You are gonna be so happy with what Nike SB have done these, um, have done with these because these truly represent ben and jerry's in dunk form and i think that they've they've really they, they've just done so well and you know we if it was light which it's not now but we'll be taking some pictures of these on foot tomorrow for the gram for sure you can wear them on the morning dog walk you know what i am i'm gonna flex on the dog walk <laughs> um i don't and just just to be clear i don't walk in fields on the morning dog walk uh, like oh, they're so it's good. an extended round the blocker we call it an extended round the blocker um, see to be honest Lee, I didn't eat Ben and Jerry's and then you picked up that vegan peanut butter oh, one it was so good. and it was so good I it was like oh I'm re I really don't fancy this because I don't, don't normally like Ben and Jerry's ice cream I do I like the fish food and then I was like, oh, my God, this is amazing. But it was the vegan one. Yeah, so good. So um, I'm a big fan of fish food, which is a which is a, a Ben & Jerry's flavor as well. Not so much into the, 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 the Chunky Monkey, mm. but I might need to revisit it um, just to, to remind myself why fish food is the best. Um, what? Buddy, I'm just like space okay <laughs> but what i'd like sj is you didn't really pick these up so what do you think like you have a little look and i'm going to put this one back in its box no they're really nice they are really nice look, i even painted my nails to match the blue yeah you um, did a good job <laughs> of, paint, of painting your nails um it'll be interesting to see how this wears the leather and yeah. the paintwork on the front but yeah no they're really nice yeah so good they have done a really good job i think I can't believe they're retail like they're they're reselling at the price that they're reselling. Oh, it's insanity! Um, you know that's that's true yeah. market dynamics. It's like s somebody that um, that I follow on Twitter, yeah. who's, who's female. She just c put a tweet up saying, "What I I don't understand. What is this Nike Ben and Jerry's thing all about?" So it just shows how much this has just crossed over. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think so. Um, I'm hoping. Well, I kind of got two hopes for for these, um, so I'm just going to put those down there. Um, I've. Uh, so what was I going to say? So I'm I'm hoping that for other Nike. So once everything gets back to normal with supply chain, that this will like this will increase people going into skate shops to buy oh, yeah. other stuff. I hope that. My counter, my other hope was that I hope that like it just it helps SB overall, um, but then my counter to that is I don't want everyone going in for the Kevin and Hell, <laughs> um, so please like just make sure that like you that you 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 yeah just be careful. Yeah, and I get a feeling that 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 the the lows of the straps are slowly growing on people. Yeah. See, we called we called the like we called the lows of the Kevin and Hell pack ages ago, and you all laughed at me because of the straps. But I think some of you are now starting to come round to my way of thinking. <laughs> um. Um. See, I don't know, Leroy. I mean, I'm I'm seeing again people that didn't give it a shit about dunks or SBs a couple of weeks ago, let alone <laughs> <laughs> a few months ago, are suddenly wanting uh, 
wanting Kevin and Brad, Kevin, Kevin, Brad, not Kevin and Perry, Kevin and Perry, <laughs> <laughs> Kevin and Perry. That won't translate for the US either. Um, yeah, you should definitely tr try um, oh with, with attitude, Levi. Um, but yeah, you should definitely do that. The straps are sick. I hope they release them in a lower size. This is for my girl. Um, I think they're going for a slightly fuller size run, Grease, so you never know. <laughs> you never know. Um, I've seen a lot of skate shops now putting stuff up. Obviously, uh, Attitude put out their, um, their, their, their creative this week, which, which we shared. Again, um, shout out to, to them for just... To, and then the Grateful Dead Bears... Well, see, uh, yeah, that that they're gonna go bananas, absolutely yeah, bananas. They are gonna go bananas, you know, and they look good in every single colorway. That's the annoying thing. All I'm saying is, I want to get a pair of those because I've already got the socks to go with them. You do. You've got the socks to match those Grateful Dead ones. So yeah, I think. Um, so it doesn't matter what colour I have. It's uh, it's gonna be interesting. I'm just curious as to what else. Um, what else is coming, just even in the GR sort of colourway? Um, there's a lot going on. There's a lot of nice GR blazers around at the moment, which is like, oh, just, just, um, just, just, yeah, nice. Too yeah. many. Um, yeah, Leroy, might as well forget the bears, probably. But we will see. We'll we see. will see. <laughs> But yes, I think they are going to ride off the increase in the Ben and Jerry Dunk hype. I'm I'm Maybe. just curious, like who knows? Like, will all of the colours be available in every location? Hmm, interesting. Or are they going to make some colours like a US, like a US special, yeah. a European special, a Japan special? Are they Are they going to make some that are ske like one colourway or w one of the colours? specific to skate shop only and then they're going to allow some of the more fashiony shops and the sneak fashiony shops and and, no. and well i'm i was just i'm trying what to think what we call in a fashiony shop uh end or oh, right, offspring okay. um, no um so yeah i uh yeah i'm in, i'm kind of intrigued uh, i heard one color was in store only well, the thing is, Le 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 Levi, <laughs> I can't... End of June, we can go in store. <laughs> can we go in store? Um, I don't know. Are we going to be able to go in store at the end of June? Yeah, 15th of June, apparently. Uh, Everyone's open for business. Well, I can't get to stores. That is true. I'm frightened to go to London. Yeah, there's, there's no way. Not going on no train. No way. Ah, there we go. Yellow is quick strike. Green is top tier. Quick strike. This is going to be complicated. This is complicated. And orange is F and F. So friends and family, yeah, they are going to go like absolute hotcakes then. Yep, they're hyped to hypery. Oh well. But these hype kids won't even know what Grateful Dead is. They don't care. I oh, know they don't. They don't care. And actually, if you think about it as well, like if you're being a bit tenuous <laughs> as I am at times, there is a continuation of the, um, this. So Ben and Jerry's obviously have the Cherry Garcia flavor, which is obviously the guy, one of the guys in the Grateful Dead. Tie Dye Nurse, Grateful Dead. Ben, so there's a connection between these dunks and those dunks. Um, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, I'll just put that back there <laughs> nicely. Um, uh, it's 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 all like da. It's all one of those. It's all one of those. So uh, yeah, I'm um you know that's obviously that what's happening on the dunk front. I think there's going to be a ton of cool blazers coming as well. Um I there already are, GR. I told you. I get the feeling though as well Nike might want to try and do something with the Bruin, um do some interesting things with that if it can. Well, they would have done if the Olympics were on, wouldn't they? Yeah, that's true. So there we go. No longer well, that's what we hope, Alwyn. Um that's what we hope. Uh, I don't know. Will they get greedy? We'll see. We'll see. Uh, yeah, uh, that that is kind of weird, Grease. Uh, and where did I get? What did I get from End? Uh, you got the track 
Truck it low. Truck it low. Because it's the only place that you yeah. could get in your size. In, in my think? size, which is weird, really, when you think about it. Like, what? Why were they in in end? Um, which is a bizarre place. Bizarre place for you know to still have an SB account. Um, it's very very odd. Um, Brewing React for four. Okay, well I'm I'm probably going to be in on that. I still want to get. Um, I'm still waiting for um the adversary oh yeah you, yeah, yeah you really want those yeah i really want those i want those for the morning walk <laughs> <laughs> i'm like working out the different <laughs> shoes that i buy for different times of the day um i wore again today the um th those green <laughs> adidas uh, that i got um earlier um on Your sale knizzers. yeah i they they just astound me every time you love them don't you i do I am so surprised at how much I love those shoes. Um, uh, okay, this is this is interesting. Um, Alwyn's always sharing like a few things in the in the in the the stream chat. I'm not gonna put them them up on there. If you are watching and uh, you uh, you haven't given a thumbs up, that would be really helpful. It kind of helps us in the old YouTube Google algorithm. Um, so yes. So the the sh the reorganisation is still vaguely going on. It is vaguely going on. I've kind of um, we've got now up in the top room where where they they migrated to into sort of our space into our attic space, which was converted before we moved in. We've um, that's mainly an SB hole now. Um, it's where I, I admire SBs. I tell you what, it's a damn sight easier finding stuff. I like just picking things out, going, oh, yeah, I'm going to go that. The, the next thing, um, uh, yep, see. Yep, you were talking. Sorry, I was uh, sorry. The, the, the next thing for me to do then with the shelves is to determine whether I move all the dunks together and all the blazers and bruins together. <laughs> And then any of the other randoms, but there's predominantly that's what it is. Probably the gattos would have to hang out with the Bruins because there's not too many of that. Yeah, but it was interesting to see how many pairs of blazers there were. Wasn't no, no, it? No, 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 no. There no, were no. quite a few. Dunks are still in it. Uh, yeah, dunks are still but it. literally, it did kind of feel at one point like every third box was a pair of blazers. No. Easily. D d dunk boys for life. Nah, easily. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> not blazing squad here. No, no blazing squads here. Definitely not. So that's th that's the intent, and then downstairs where they uh, where they're supposed to live, um, we're actually putting over a shelf entirely for SJ properly, who has more shoes than anyone <laughs> realizes. Um, well, see, J. Dolan, they were supposed to live really on one wall, <laughs> but then like they were actually supposed to live in here. If I'm honest, at one point the thought was that we would. Like we had in our in the uh, in the place that we rented, um, if you remember some of the videos when we first came back from the US, that we filmed with them behind us, and um, my intent was originally when I when we saw this was to move them into here, but now that I look around, well, first of all, the first racking, of all, the racking was a little bit too tall for this. A little for bit, this, <laughs> a little bit. The, the racking's taller than me, and my my head hits the ceiling in here. So, like, the ceiling height in here is six foot three-ish. Um, we um, would have to pay to dig this down properly. Yeah, I'm not doing that. That's, that too sounds much scary. Hassle. Sounds scary. It sounds expensive. It is expensive. I'm not doing that. So, um, so finding the racking from that company online was significantly uh, better. Yeah, it just means... It means what? There's a lot of sneakers up there. There is. Um... <laughs> New superstars coming oh in June. Dear. Two collabs. Okay, really intrigued to see what they are then, Alwyn. So uh, yeah, that's a that's good to know. Like I'm, um, and obviously they'll be in that in that slightly wider, that wider profile. Maybe SJ, this could be the moment when you try a superstar again. Um, no, I don't know. SJ needs more coffee. I need my bed. Honestly, I was like up at one, and then five, and then went downstairs and just flopped on the sofa because I felt like crap and then the dog decided to come with me. Yeah. Then it got light. Yeah. And then he was woke me up at five. 
Yeah. So yeah, not good. And then he had me awake. <laughs> From five. <laughs> Cheers, dog. <laughs> Who's now fast asleep under the table he here? Is. He's like, if we could put a camera down there, you'd see him fast asleep. <laughs> um, you should have got those Gons ones. Um, they are super nice. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, we still got to film a proper on foot with these. Um, have you worn them properly? Yet? No, not no, yet. No, I didn't think you had. No, not yet. I was. Uh, but like, look, like just to remind everyone, like these are super nice. So these are Adidas skateboarding ones. Um, Alwyn tells me that they're like I never had the old ones, and they never. F I tried them on a few times. I didn't ever think I looked right in them, but these are, are fractionally wider. And they're, they're really comfy. Really, really comfy. Um, the leather on them is phenomenal, as I said in the video. Uh, they still feel really waxy. I don't know what it is about the leather on them. It's so nice. It smells, you know what? You know, it smells like real leather. Yep, it's definitely got that sort of nice leather smell, um, if you know what I mean. Um, and there's his sad schmoo. He has a sad <laughs> schmoo on Shmoo, <laughs> schmoo, schmoo. Um, what was all that dirt that just dropped out on your laptop? Uh, oh. <laughs> uh, that's just a bit of fluff from the shoe. Ooh. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. What on earth? Oh, I don't know. I don't want to know what that is. We won't ask what that is. Oh. Uh, all kinds of rubbish falling out onto the laptop. <laughs> oops, 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 oops. No one sees shmoo. that. Shmoo, shmoo. Shmoo, shmoo. So um, yeah, um, <laughs> it's like a fifteen-year-old shoe, and it's still still going, Jay Dolan. That's impressive. That is impressive. I suppose for everybody else, like who's 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 on the stream, like, um, what's your oldest beta then that's still surviving? Because I'm kind of curious. Um, Horror King uh, wants to know. Oh yeah, sorry, you yeah, answered said, that. Yeah. yeah, we're definitely going in for Kevin and Hell. Definitely um, twice. <laughs> all in um yeah i'm just worried about nike sizing at the moment though which is yeah. slightly frustrating so we have heard a rumor that for um smaller nike sizing at the moment that it's gone it's it's um it's gone down in size a little bit to you know as they as they try and do like a full range of sizes to accommodate women's feet as well or just bent g generally be i suppose not not accommodate women's feet i didn't mean that to be more <laughs> to be more to be more unisex with their sizing so actually running from like a 3.5 or whatever it is all the way up to like a 13 14 um wow you've still got those going that's nuts grease and um i was just saying to 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 levi there hang on you're, you're like jumping around conversation what you were talking about something else and then you just jumped into... Oh, it's a waffle. All right, okay. I, just, I have the prerogative yeah. of okay. doing that. Okay, all right. Of doing that. What, what was I talking about? Sizing. Sizing. I, th I thought I'd finished the sizing. Oh, yeah. I wasn't really listening. Yeah. <laughs> I switched. <laughs> <laughs> You're not listening to me on the waffle. Oh, dear, SJ. <laughs> oh, what do you do? Let's put you on mute no, for the moment. The there you go. You're on mute. Um, so you can't hear SJ making all kinds of noises now she's off mute uh, there we go so that's um yeah they're your summer specials exactly i see that's the thing um that is the only day when you wear shoes that old um uh that's that's crazy see we don't have um any neighbors that we <laughs> could talk to about shoes uh, but i wish i could talk to our neighbors about shoes well i can't really talk to them but you know well, one side we don't get on with. That's true. And the other side is a... A very old lady. A very old lady who's very nice. She's very lovely, but I don't think she'll appreciate... Sneakers. Sneakers in, no, in the same not. way. Um, that's kind of nuts. And so what Silverbox SBs is it, Le Levi, is what I wanted to ask. Um, so which ones? And do you wear them like on a daily basis? <laughs> Talk uh, about my life. Off topic. So, best Nike SB dunks to buy from StockX. Well, depends on like. It depends on your budget. It depends on your budget because if you th there are. If you're like absolutely loaded, go <laughs> fill your boots. Um, but there are others out there. Um, you've really just got to 
Like there, there's many on there. I was looking at some earlier that weren't that far off retail, um, but they've all gone up certainly over the last the last twelve months. I'm going to be honest. Um, I because I often I often have a little look on here just to see. And uh, can you filter from lowest lowest asks? Let's have a look. Apply. Um, so you can get. Oh, hello. Uh, well, that's oh, below three hundred dollars. Uh, okay, so let's go for new highest bids. No. Um, yep. <laughs> well, it depends whether you want old or new as well. As yeah. in as in new release stuff that you haven't been able to pick up or something that's more blast from the past. Yeah. So they've got like they've got the truck it high. Um which uh which is on there in the UK money at eighty nine pounds. That's a great shoe. You can also pick that up from retail at the moment. Um they've got the dunk mid orange label um lowest ask on that is eighty nine pounds again. So less than that. And that that's harder to find at retail, but the quality of that is um uh, not a big high fan. Okay, so you've got the Decon Black, um, lowest last 90. Now, randomly, this is a strange one. Now, this wasn't a really popular one, but there's the Dunk Low Soul and Friday Part 2. It's not a very popular um, It's not a very popular one, but it's on here at 92. Even the Ben G's at 99. That's nuts. Well, let me have a look at that. That can't be right. Can't be right. Ah, uh, no, no, it's not. Highest bid is eighty five. Lowest ask is one hundred and sixty nine. Last sale um, was at eighty six pounds. Now, obviously, you know, I think you just need to look around. Um, uh, you know, there's still stuff at retail. Um, oh my word! So that's your friend, Alwyn. Uh, oh my word! Wow! 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 Two point eight. Okay. That's insanity, isn't it? That is. Huh. Well, you know, I uh, yeah. I can't get my head around that really. That's it. There's nuts. Overall nuts. Hey, Tony, how you doing? Um, say it. Hi, everybody. Um, yeah, I like the pricing is just crazy. You can find bargains. You just have to go and like look. Uh, I would say, um, you know, you have to think about what you like yourself. Yeah, uh, you got it's got to be something that you like and s something that you're probably gonna wear um, because you know there's some GRs from the last couple of years or even some quick strokes that are just not popular. But I actually think are oh, are in that. Are we talking chunky I've resale? I've already responded. We are. We are. Um, that's some crazy, crazy prices. Um, he wins every single ref on there. Seems a bit fishy. I haven't won anything from Flat Spot since my Friday Solent. Um Actually, you won them for me. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I went. I had a run. And I did too. I had a run with Flat Spot yeah. for a while. <laughs> Yeah, me too. <laughs> I just think more people are entering. Yeah. I also think, Leroy, I think you have a really popular size because yours sort of transcends slightly bigger women's feet Yes, that's uh, as true. well. So, you know, if th if there's more women buying these sneakers as well, you know, you're, you're going to be in a similar sort of position to me where I just think it's a, a slightly harder size to get. Wow, that's nuts. Northern Lights were a while ago. We were still in the US when the Northern Lights came out. Um, I think, if it's the ones I think, they weren't they from Premier? Oh, hmm. I, I can't remember. Um, and, and I get a half size as well. So, yeah, but what we did for a while, like I did well on that UK 10, 10 and a half. Um, our end of 2014, Northern oh, Lights. Oh, wow. Okay. No, we weren't quite there then at that point. Um, I for some reason I thought that they were from Premier um, in the US, but maybe not, maybe not. Um, so yeah, I, I, I don't know because for a while as well we did well on Note, and then that that started to dry up. Um, we haven't got anything on Consortium in the past, have we? Uh, no, not when they've had like 
raffles or no. anything just because it always crashes we've um i've bought from remix casuals in the past but never in a raffle type situation uh board of south sea yeah i've, d I've done I, I got got the griffies from there i was just really quick in their app uh uh i okay so i uh, yeah okay thanks thanks for clarifying that levi i thought they did um i think that something must have just come up on their their, their newsletter when i first signed up with them when when we moved over and maybe that's why i just got that just got to carpet bomb yeah that's kind of true uh uh i ent only entered one raffle says jay dolan wow um the Rony situation I think that that's true, Grease. It's it, I think that's very true, and just the hype at the moment. Um, see, that's that's handy. That's very handy. Um, it's uh, well, we know someone who entered more than that, and they didn't get lucky, Le Levi. Um, they had a, they yeah, they just didn't do. Uh, not many raffles cater for your size, but see, but that's when you enter a raffle, Jay Dolan. Because it's your size, um, is is that size? Um, oh, are all coming in a UK for US Jay? Did you see that? They're all coming in my size. Oh yes. Hey, hey. So, uh, um, oh, and Greece got a win on Welcome in Leeds. Uh, yeah, I can't normally enter their raffles anymore because they have they use that um, the geocoding thing, which yeah. it, which is actually really which good. Which is clever. It's really good. Um, but yeah, it's kind of nuts. It's absolutely nuts. So has anybody else seen anything that they're kind of feeling at the moment? Um, I really like. As I said, there's just so many gr blazers that are so nice at the moment. Like there's those sort of sail with the blue swoosh the mids mm -hmm. then there's the, the two lows the the blue with the gum sole that remind me of a pair of your dunks yep. your dunk mids in a similar colorway and there's also the sort of off-white with the yellow swoosh they're both just all really nice clean gr blazers but that's all i've really seen that i like oh the clot air max one yeah that's that's pretty nice uh, Navy low SB blazers. <laughs> yep. Uh, uh, I'm I gonna say Grease about those Nat Geo vans. I'm not sure. I quite like it. I just is it vans? You know, we've said this before. Vans just do so uh, many collabs. I feel it gets a bit diluted, which is a shame. Yeah. Because when they do a really good collab. It is normally really good. I, I haven't bought a pair of vans in ages. No. Um, and the Noah Box, talking about the Air Max 1 Tokyo Maze, yeah, they are amazing. Um, <laughs> is that a pun? Um, but <laughs> yeah, uh, I really like them. I've got them upstairs. They're, they're nice. We had them out the other week. Um, they do look absolutely banging. Um, yes. I'm I'm up up there with you. I'm, uh, but uh, I'm I'm. There's so as always. There's always so many great shoes out there. Yeah, that's part of the problem. Isn't that it? is part of the it's problem. Just so much decent stuff. I also wanted to. Um, I just wanted to. You know, like obviously we 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 have our our, our podcast um, s sneakers and stories, but. Um, Andy, who was on one of our um, podcasts, Andy underscore 0161, he was actually on a, a US podcast this this week, and um, it's it's the Sneak Dis Sneaker Podcast, talking about the UK sneaker scene, and he he mentioned us at the start of it, which was kind of humbling and kind of I want to say it nearly brought a tear to my eye, but I, I it was just a bit weird, I wasn't was, it? I was quite tired, but you should go and listen to it. It's, it's um, on the Sneak Dis. Pod, sneaker podcast um it was on sunday Andy posted the link on on one of his facebook groups so and he usually joins us on sunday where he's uh, he's often working on a wednesday so he can't can't join the waffle very often but yeah you should go and listen to that he's uh you know he's talking about um i suppose his views on the uk sneaker scene and, and uk uk sneaker <laughs> scene and uh the uk sneaker <laughs> culture so i thought it was kind of interesting um oh 
See now, there's a tr- there's a tough question. What do we think? They're such different sneakers. You can't <laughs> compete. You oh. can't. Does it have to be a fight? <laughs> Can they all just get along? Uh, I want to throw that back on the screen again. Uh, the Jade Horizon is just super nice, and so our wind saying J- infrared first, Jade second, Blue Fury third. I would kind of agree with that. Um, are they allowed to tie for first position? Because <laughs> um, I'd probably go with the infrared and jade. Blue Fury, I really like the blue, but I have the jade and the infrared. And um, the jade I got for Christmas, so it, it's an extra special shoe for me. It looks super clean with a certain pair of stance socks I have. And um, yeah, exactly agrees. It depends on that. The infras are amazing, and I think that they are a really great interpretation of what that shoe was into a dunk. So, and the Hennessy or, or the Muslin, like, I really like it. I prefer them over the Blue Flip Fury. But I just never stood a chance. No. Never should have. Which is a shame. I entered ra- a raffle for Wallabies. <laughs> <laughs> really? Are there raffles for Wallabies now? Yeah, on, on are end. They, are they a thing again? Yeah. I suppose they've never not, they're never not been, been a, a thing. thing. Yeah, um, that they aren't my. They're uh, not my thing. The Clark Wallabies. Yes, they are very much a thing. Um, Grease loves seeing the infrareds. Let's put this up for the annex. Infrared one, Blue Fury two, Jade Horizon three. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm only going to say the Jades higher because I have them and they and I know what they look like on foot. I think is is going to be my my. I think they were retort. sort of underrated. Uh, and focus still waiting on their delivery of Hennepe- Hennessy's. Okay, and stance stance socks are life. I'd say stance socks for life. <laughs> yes, I was looking this morning. Um, I was thinking, okay, so so Jay Dolan sent me um, a picture on Instagram of um, of these tie dye socks that he's going to match with his his chunky donkeys and so clearly my first port of call was well i'm gonna go and have a look on stunts um so the annex prefers jay clay um i think we just got so into stunts when when we were in the u.s um yeah uh, because they're they're so easy to get over there and uh grease pray for gum souls definitely definitely always pray for gum (laughs) souls as you can see, and uh, I think I uh, I have that on, on some other things as well. But uh, actually, oh, you didn't bring your merch down. No, I'm not going upstairs. Okay, well, merch, look at that. It finally came. So th- what was the biggest problem with this black T-shirt? Was it printed in about three days? Um, but... The posting from Latvia to the UK took forever. Now, the printers are assuring me that they're getting better flights now out of Latvia. But that took like a month to get this. Um, but yeah, it's I'm really happy with the print on it. Doesn't look good, SJ. Um, that's the one. But I think that depends on your wardrobe, yeah. really. I would say, in which case, to be honest, I would say the infrareds are the most versatile out of those three. Yeah, I think... I think they go with anything. Oh. <laughs> See, this is a... Um, and I'm not surprised you did, Alwyn, sell that many. So I'm just saying it's controversial now for Philip. He just wants us to recommend one <laughs> shoe. Uh, <laughs> oh, my word. That's crazy. Okay, so I think SJ's right. I think the infrareds are probably the most versatile. You can wear them with so many different types of clothes, different um, fits. Uh, I think they go with pretty much any color because they're gray and red and black. Like that's a classic colorway. They just go with everything. Um, so what's exactly what's SJ said? I've said sock games. Um, yep. For sure. So yeah, it's um that's a tricky one. But yeah, this and this shirt eventually will be on um the Pint of Stuff website. I just don't want to put it on now because I can't trust how long it's going to take the printers to get things to anyone. Like in the US, they're printed in the US, 
um, and they are very much, uh, they were printed in California, somewhere in the Midwest, and they had to shuffle around their, their, their locations for printing, and some were printed in, the, in Mexico as well, although I think they've had to furlough, or no, they've had to just slow the, the stuff down there. In Europe, they've just opened a facility in Barcelona, so I'm hoping that printing for the UK might start to come from there rather than Latvia. I think that that might be a faster print, but we'll see. But uh, no, I've, I think it's come out really well. Like we've got some other souls that we that we need to photograph and work on. What's um, in the lane? Uh, do you know Fitz in general? <laughs> so I'm going to be honest, Levi. I don't personally do that because um, <laughs> no, don't do I. As about as close as I get to do it to laying it out is literally I'll go in, look at the shoes, and go right. Hmm, what am I feeling today? Right, I really want to wear that type of shoe today. Then I like will go down into the sock, the sock drawer. And might be looking to match, and then from there, really, it's just like, what, what else can I throw on? Um, you know, I think that's about as I think, but I think a lot of people, you're right, um, like influencers definitely do that. Um, I haven't got the inclination to do that, really, like, not completely, like, especially now. I'm like, in lockdown, I can't be off. Yeah, I'm, I'm not <laughs> doing that. <laughs> This is wearing your beach gear. Yeah. <laughs> I came down yesterday at lunch and you were like, why are you dressed as if you're going to the beach? Uh, Philip wants to know if there's any <sighs> SBs still sitting at stores. Uh, there will be. I think you just have to hunt them out. Um, you know, it depends where you're based, Philip. Um, no, it's Blondie. It's Blondie. Uh, it's shirt. You wore Puma socks with Jordans today, Joe. That isn't that a sin. Hasn't Jay Dolan committed one of the cardinal sins? I suppose Adidas with with Nike would be worse. Um, yeah, I love this top. Yeah, so Chuck it highs are definitely favorite. sitting. Um, uh, I think um, what. So what with the UK now enjoying some good weather, what I'm basically going through is everything that I've bought and not worn, and I wear that in the morning when we're walking the dog, and then I get my beaters for the park. Um, so it's a, uh, I yeah, you just can't I, I don't think I like I could wear Adidas pants or top with Nike, I just can't do, um, I can't do. Uh, socks things. You should um, have you looked on. So you, so Denmark would be classified as Europe. So you should have a look on Attitude Inc., which is obviously a UK store. They will I believe they will ship to Denmark. Um, you should also check out. That's exactly what I was going to say. Skate Deluxe. They will definitely ship there. They're based in Germany. Um, Bonkers in Frankfurt. Frankfurt. Um, they ship. Yeah, I think. But you know, at the moment. Dunks are selling pretty quickly, so it depends on your, just depends on your sizing. Um, uh, <laughs> 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 oh dear, like like, <laughs> Owen's just not a fan of Puma anymore. He's 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 scarred. He's mentally scarred. I think I think he's definitely mentally scarred for that. So um, yeah. It's um. Wait, how, long, how long have we been doing this tonight? We've Nearly been an hour. Fi Fifty-five minutes. Yeah. SJ's still hanging in with us. I'm really struggling. You're really struggling. Yeah. Do you want to turn the lights down? No. Do you want us to like um, sing you a meditation thing? Or <laughs> Definitely not. An incantation or whatever they call it when you go to that <laughs> yoga thing. Uh, <laughs> so uh, yeah, I think you should put some more boomers <laughs> on there, and I think you should tag Alwyn. Every time you upload a Puma <laughs> picture. Um, and so there we go, just to be clear. So Alwyn ships to Denmark. Um, that's Attitude Inc. Um, let me see. Am I allowed to put links in the chat myself of my own thing? Is the... Uh, <laughs> Are you going to get banned? Is the chat box going to get stop banned me? from your own bot? Uh, it is. Uh, <laughs> let's have a look. Let's just go there. <laughs> Uh, so we are just gonna 
I'm just going to throw the link in the chat. Uh, hopefully that will work. Boom. Yeah, it works. Uh, so that's... <laughs> Be Michelle Sue. <laughs> don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Is it an original shell suit? Because if it is, if, it, if it's an original 80s, 90s yeah, shell suit. There's seven of in blimmin' urban outfits yeah, just now, aren't they? Exactly. It's hilarious. Yeah. Like the ones that people would buy off the market. Exactly. Off the market shell suits that are now <laughs> sold in um, urban outfitters. For like four times the price they were. Exactly. Off the market. Completely. <laughs> Completely. <laughs> um, <laughs> So yeah, it's uh did you guys see the Neymar twenty I no. think I might have done, but because it was I, I, Neymar I, I, I would kind have of yeah, I would have just like just went uh no. really. Um let's have a look. Let's have a look. I'm on sneaker news now, I'm just having a look. Uh no. I'm not feeling it. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest. We'll probably throw it up in the in Sneaker Streaming Sunday um, just so that you guys can all vote on it. Or are you only ever talking Dunks or Nike SB? No, no, not at all. Um, we, we tend to drift that way. Um, but I will also talk for my longing of um, whether I should buy n New Balance we always bring up vans as a thing. I don't know, like the like the, the Air Max 2090. And for a while, I was feeling Air Max 1s again, um, Air Max 90s. I don't know. There's something a bit peculiar Lego about... Lego-like. Lego-like. Let's have another look at the pictures, SJ. No, I'm not a fan of these at all. Like, I'm not a Neymar fan for various reasons um, that we won't go into. Yeah, I know I need to buy them, Jay Dolan. I know I do. I need to buy this. I, I'm i going to be honest. I don't think I feel the pro, f the, the, the silhouette. I'm not sure on it. It's like <laughs> it's like a blended 90 and uh, was it a 270 kind of thing? And didn't you, didn't somebody describe these like this, the 2090 as like a Star Trek ship? I Maybe, don't I don't know. You know what? I think I think save it for for um uh Sunday. Um oh thank you Philip. That's uh, that's really kind of you to say. Uh yeah, we we enjoy talking to everybody in the thing. I was just talk um we on in the stream on the the Wednesday waffle and on the podcast as well. I think um <laughs> it's too long for YouTube, Alwyn. It's more. It's too like. Stop jumping around. Uh, sorry, um, <laughs> sorry. My brain. It's like it's tired. I had a long day. I've been up since five. Um, so what was I going to say? You what? were answering Phil, and ah, then yes. you jumped to another so, question. So I was saying thank you to Phil, to Tia, to Tone. I'm saying uh, we do cover our stuff. We just tend to drift into the dunk thing. That's what we've always done. Um, jump up, jump up, and get down uh yeah i think sj's had enough i of, have to be honest yeah so i think what we're going <laughs> to do everyone just as we hit 58 <laughs> minutes and 23 seconds i know we never have any structure to this waffle um that's that's the point of um of of these so i think we're gonna say good night thank you for joining us um i as always people look after yourselves st stay safe and all of that um you know, hopefully it's a sunny day tomorrow wherever you are, and so you can get out and see the skies and just like chill and stuff. Um, why? Because SJ. I should have called in sick, shouldn't I? You should have done. Call in sick. I was actually asleep on the sofa. Yes. Before we filmed your unboxing. Yeah. yeah. Um, so. We, you will see us all on Sunday. Hopefully, uh, I'll feel better. Yeah, hopefully, I'll <laughs> feel, feel, feel better. Um, and I will hopefully we'll find a way to get that video edited and up and live tomorrow. Um, I might need to get up early to do it, um, which, given how light it is in the morning, I probably will. So, thank you, everybody. Thanks for joining. Um, as always, it's you that makes this a fun stream. So, um, yeah, it's it's been a blast as always. <laughs> I can't believe I showed you the inner soul of that blazer. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll see you all later, people. Uh, au revoir. 
SJ. Yeah, bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Sorry, bye-bye. <laughs> I, I was typing. I can't type and talk at the moment.